Uh, I'm delighted to uh, co-chair with Peter Levine the World Economic Forum in Europe, in Brussels. Uh, delighted to have this opportunity and we're looking forward to discussing a number of key issues. I, I guess the first is the obvious one, it's the economy. Uh, and we're looking for stronger growth in Western Europe in particular to counterbalance the growth that we're seeing in Asia and Latin America and Africa and the Middle East. And most interestingly, already in the first quarter of this year, the turnaround that we've seen in the United States. Uh, we don't want Europe, Western Europe in particular, to fall behind. So the first point is the strength of the European economy, particularly the Western European economy. Uh, the second big issue is sustainability uh, and the varied issues that we as heads of companies have in terms of corporate social responsibility or corporate responsibility and making sure that we, we take forward some of the progress we made in Copenhagen, not enough clearly, but these issues of climate, social issues, environmental issues are critical issues that we have to make further progress on. And the third area last but not least, is given the fact that we have new representation for Europe, is ensuring that Europe as a whole has a significant role in geopolitical issues and security issues around the world. Uh, clearly with this new leadership we'll be looking for improved visibility uh, and improved involvement both with the West and the East and the South. By the South I mean the growing power and influence of Latin America as well as the growing power and influence of Asia, uh, of the Middle East and of course Africa. So Europe has a, a, has a, a force uh, on the geopolitical and security stage. So there's a high hopes for our conference in Brussels and, and the World Economic Forum coming to Europe uh, and we look forward to engaging with you on this. A, a, a final plea uh, from somebody who's trying to run a major global company, uh, and that is to reduce the bureaucracy and burden and regulation that we see not only at a national level but also at a European level too. We have to streamline government just as the political parties are saying in front of the UK election here in, in London uh, and elsewhere in the UK at this time. So reducing the regulatory burden I think is a critical issue for those of us who are trying to run private enterprises. Look forward to seeing you in Brussels.